cowpoke been riding out one dark and windy day. Upon a ridge he rested as he went along his way. When all at once a mighty herd of red-eyed cows he saw a plowing through the ragged skies and up a cloudy draw. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the night's episode of Canadian Championship Wrestling here on Friday nights from Ottawa, Ontario. We've got a special show for you tonight, a two out of three falls match between newcomer to the area Conrad Williams and whipper Billy Watson making his return to the area. This is the only match on the schedule. It is expected to be a long one and a fantastic match. Let's head down to the ring. On this March 17th episode, as we're about to begin springtime here in Ottawa, here comes Conrad Williams. The following contest is a two out of three falls match. Making his way to the ring from Auckland, New Zealand, weighing in at 242 pounds, Williams Connor. Conrad Williams out of Auckland, New Zealand, the 38-year-old, making his first appearance here on Friday nights in Ottawa. He likes to finish his opponents off by delivering a hard, charging tackle that he learned from his rugby playing days down under. Billy Watson out of Toronto, the 14-year vet, should be a mainstay here in the in the Ottawa area, as his home region just down in down the in the uh, road in Ontario, Toronto. The master of what he calls the commando unconscious, a sleeper hold. Also known to use the spinning toe hold, the 34-year-old Watson. It should be an excellent match. It should go quite the distance, ladies and gentlemen. Two out of three falls are signed for this final winter Friday here in Ottawa. The snow is starting to melt, or at least we hope, as we move into the spring of 1950. Sixty-minute time limit, and we are underway. Watson with a forearm smash right into. Con oh, Conrad with a throw. This should be quite the melee, ladies and gentlemen. Conrad reversing things. Going to deliver a back suplex. The Ottawa Auditorium faithful is quite packed, and they are quite wild for this match. Williams sending Watson into the ropes. Watson, or Williams missing with a double axe handle, and Watson. Watson going for an early pin, trying to get a win. Puts on an arm bar. Grape vines a leg as well. He's pulling back two limbs. Williams does not submit. He gets out of the hold. Holding on to his left arm though. Watson, some more forearm smashes. Williams gonna beal him across the ring. Now stomps to the back. Shoulder blades. Williams all over Whipper Billy Watson. He's going to drag Watson and go for the cover. But the referee can't get in position in time. Watson, a former NWA British Empire heavyweight champion, nine times he's held the belt, just recently lost it the end of January. He's also a former world heavyweight champion and a former NWA world heavyweight champion. So Watson is no stranger to the ring mat. 
Conrad Williams delivering a fireman's carry slam. Williams has won several titles of his own right in New Zealand. Pile driver out of Watson. This could be an early end of the first fall, but Watson not going for the pin. Instead, he's going to... What is he going to do? He's... Ooh, he's going to yank back on Williams' arms. Hard move to hold on to, apparently. He's going to drag Williams across the ring and go for the cover. And Williams kicks out at one. A couple weeks back, we saw a young wrestler by the name of Edward Williams. There's no relation between the two. Conrad getting to his feet. Fights his way out. High knee right into Whipper Billy Watson's face. Ladies and gentlemen, Conrad Williams signaling that he is in control. But Watson says no dice as he fights back out, delivering a clothesline, and now dragging Conrad into the center of the ring where he's going to go for the cover. Nope. He's going to lock on another arm grapevine bar type hold. And Conrad refusing to give up. He's going to fight his way out. He does get out. That arm has suffered more damage. It's Watson's game plan seems to be working with the arm. And we've got a nerve hold, a claw hold, if you will, on to Whipper Billy Watson's right trapezius muscle. Williams goes for the cover. Not hooking the leg, and Watson kicks out. Flips Williams over, and Watson gonna celebrate to the fans for a second. Ooh, hard kick to the face, a double kick. As Williams was laying in the corner, and Watson, Williams reversing things, delivering a shoulder tackle. Now he's going to get on top of Watson and just pound him as the referee lets him get away with these punches. These closed fist punches which are not legal here in Ottawa. Side leg sweep, take down. And now Williams locking on a lower back hook. Great yanking back on the forehead, actually covering Watson's face. Watson's able to get out the back door. Double chop. What? Williams kicks out. Watson dropping Williams across the top rope. Goes for the cover. But Williams is able to get three. No three count. The match, the first fall continues. Williams with the European uppercut. More reversal of a reversal sends Watson in the corner. We're five minutes gone by in the first fall. Williams gonna whip Watson. They're gonna crisscross action. Oh, the tackle on Williams. That's his signature move. He's gonna drag Whipper Billy Watson into the center of the ring and go for the cover. He might have used too much time celebrating though. The referee out of position one, two, and Watson kicks out. Conrad Williams took time to celebrate his move to show the fans what he had done. And now Williams, relentless, going right to the hard fist, the hard right hand, stops in the gut. Watson reversing things. Test of strength. Watson, look at the strength from the former world champion as he lifts Williams and throws him in the corner. Bear hug suplex out of Conrad Williams as he continues to hold the power. Using that iron claw hold again on the, the right shoulder whipper Billy Watson. Watson continuing to stun Williams. Williams with the clothesline. Conrad Williams takes time to show off his build. He no doubt has worked hard in the ring to earn or in the gym. Watson slamming Williams down face first in the ring. Now he's gonna go for that spinning oh a spinning leg grapevine of some sorts. 
and the Williams gives up the first fall perhaps just to get out of that hold the fall the second fall immediately starts we were six minutes and 58 seconds in when Williams gave up Watson kicks at the right leg and now sending Williams into the ring missing with an uppercut he immediately locks him back up. Williams spinning through the hold. Takes down Williams. Watson, I should say, takes down Williams. And then a spinning leg hold slam into the mat. Watson allowing Williams to get up. Oh, Williams reverses the thing and he drives Watson head first into the canvas. Back to another Russian leg sweep. Williams dragging Watson to the center of the ring. He's going to go for the pin, try to even up the falls. But Watson kicks out. Williams. Not sure what to do now with whip for Billy Watson. Sends him into the corner. Williams taking his time. Looking for that running tackle again. He hits it. Telling the ref to get ready to count the three. As he hit that running tackle twice now, his rugby style tackle rolls Watson over. One, two, and three. And Conrad Williams at not eight minutes and 29 seconds is even the, the matchup. <clears throat> Back flips Watson off. We're even at one fall apiece. We're now in the deciding fall. Williams with a scoop slam. Watson reverses thing, lands on his feet, grabs both arms and delivers a German suplex. It's going for another leg grapevine type hold while yanking back on the chin. And yes, we got a winner at 8 minutes and 8 seconds. Whipper Billy Watson gets a submission, gets two submissions, wins the match, two falls to one. Whipper Billy Watson just too strong for Conrad Williams. Conrad Williams had some physical at some physical power moves. But was not able to stay out of Whipper Billy Watson's grasp. Watson winning the first fall by submission and the third fall by submission. So Whipper Billy Watson could be back on target here. Trying to get back into the title picture. He gets the win over Conrad Williams. And ladies and gentlemen, that's our first time seeing Williams. Watson is the victor. Well, the match didn't go as long as we thought it would, but thanks for joining us anyway here on this Friday night from Ottawa, Ontario. Stay tuned next week as we move into the springtime. We'll have another exciting slate of contests coming your way on Canadian Championship Wrestling.